Ladies and welcome back to Silicon Gear 58. I am Faith and today I am bringing you as promised one of the main concept wigs that I showed you in the booklet when I did my last main concept video. I told you that I was looking for a wig called Bora. Now this is she and they sent her to me recently and I have her in the color SR1B Black Silver. So it's SR1B Black Silver but her name is rctd 211 bora but you can probably just look her up as bora i wanted this wig because i just thought that the style was really pretty and i didn't know what color they were going to send me so they decided to send me this color she is a trendy she has a trendy curtain bang so i'm assuming it's a swoop and this is from their red carpet premium collection so let me show you what she looks like this is her i haven't taken the netting off of her yet so let's do that now yeah, I have been looking forward to getting this one. Now, right away, I love the way the um, curls are. I love the way the curls are. It's not, um, they're not really tight, but they're kind of flowy. So let's see what the front looks like. This is my first time taking it out, so you're seeing it as I'm seeing it. I always wonder what this thing is for. I'll have to ask somebody why that's on there. But uh, yeah, it's a little, yeah, I don't know what that's about. But, oh, now it's sticking to my fingers. Okay, so she has a side part. So there it is. Um, she probably could stand to be opened up a little bit because she's a little tight, the side part. And let's see, as far as the front goes, she's not really pluckable. So she is the equivalent to a regular lace front. So we're just going to cut the lace off and we're going to put her on and um, I'll put my face on. I'll be right back. I know I said I was going to put my makeup on, but I'm going to show you guys how I take hair out of the part. I don't use tweezers. I just use a rat tail comb. And I'll just go through and start picking up like little pieces here. And then instead of using a pair of tweezers, I just take my fingers and wrap my finger around it and just start pulling it out just so I can you know open up that part on one side or the other so that's all I'm doing here so I'm just pulling up a little bit that I'm seeing in here and you can some people take you know larger bunches but I'm always afraid I'm gonna tear the lace up if I do that so I'm just gonna pull it out just a few hairs at a time to open this part up just a little bit so yeah because this part is kind of tight and since I can't pluck the front of it I would really like the part to look decent I'm not really as familiar with how Main Concept does their wigs in terms of the different ones. I'm trying to get more familiar with that, but I don't know what's typical with them anymore in term. I mean, yet, <laughs> in terms of um, their lace fronts and their lace parts and that kind of thing. So I'm just pulling these out. See if the part's getting a little bit better. I don't know if you can see, but the part's getting a little bit better. So I'm just going to keep on going down the line. Just pulling a few hairs out at a time. Twisting them around my finger. I think I might have shown this in a video a long time ago, but not recently. Yeah, that's better. Okay, 
Now I'm going to put my face on. Okay, ladies, I put my face on and changed my clothes a little bit, and I'm going to put um, Bora on my head. But before I do, let me show you what she looks like on the inside. I didn't do that. She has two combs on either side of the part. They're very close to the part. She has a comb in the back and adjustable straps. And again, like I told you, there's really no place to pluck it in the front. So. All right, ladies, I am back with Bora. What do you think? First glance, what do you think? I think she's pretty. I think this dark gray color is very pretty. I love the way the curls fall. This is called, they're calling this a trendy curtain bang, and I like that. Um, I'm bringing my own edges out on the side for this wig, and I could probably put a little glue right here, but since I don't want to glue it, I'm not going to do that, but you can do that. She is a yakky texture. She is not silky. She's a yakky texture, and I really like that about this wig. She is probably between small head and medium head friendly because I have a 22 inch head and she's a bit tight on my head, especially here in the front. And that's where my headaches come. So I probably would not be able to wear this wig for a long period of time because it's, it's a little tight on my head. But if you have a smaller head, then you're good. So yeah, I showed you the back. This is all the hair in the back. Yeah, that's the way it looks there. And uh, like I told you guys before, main concept had um, sent me these little booklets that show you the different wigs that are coming and Bora was one of the ones that were coming and I wanted to make sure that I showed you this wig. Let me just read you some of the specs on here. It says it has pre-plucked edges, four inch deep lace parts, sophisticated style, realistic baby hairs, skin tone blending, HD lace, breathable cap, secure straps and combs. And uh, this, the lace actually doesn't bother my skin color in terms of ne needing to do anything to it. And again, there's nothing really here for you to do anything to except the part. And as you saw, I plucked that out because it was a little bit too uh, thin for me. So yeah, but I'm digging this color. I'm digging the texture. I think this is a great wig for um, mature women and even for younger women who like to wear gray. I think this wig looks really, really good. Uh, I want to thank Main Concept uh, for sending me this unit. And thank you guys for watching. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscription button and the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my uploads. And as I always say, if you're going to show love to anyone today, ladies, please show it to the creator. I'm still looking good, and of course, so are you. See you next time.